This is video six in the series all about HPV. If there was a vaccine that you could take to prevent cancer, would you get it? Today I'm going to talk about the HPV vaccine, which helps prevent cervical, anal, and vulvar cancers, and more. This is the first video on two giving information about the HPV vaccine. I'm going to address three questions. How does the vaccine protect you? Can you get HPV from the vaccine? And why get the vaccine? What does it protect you from? Welcome to Dr. Kathy at Your Cervix. My name is Dr. Kathy Wolf. I'm an award-winning OBGYN who was a registered nurse prior to this. I am blessed and I'm trying to give back by helping make sense of women's healthcare questions so that you can become a healthier you. Question one, how does the vaccine work? The vaccine is made from VLPs, they're virus-like particles. Simply put, viruses have two components, an hour layer of proteins known as capsid proteins and an inner layer of genetic material. After a virus gets into your body, it needs that inner genetic material to reproduce itself, to make more of itself. By having more virus in your body, that worsens the infection and the damage that the virus can do to you. The HPV vaccine is made up of virus-like particles based on the outer layer of capsid proteins, not the internal genetic material and not a live virus. Once you get the vaccine, then your body will make antibodies. What are antibodies? They are proteins that your body makes to fight off viruses, bacteria, things that invade your body. When you have received the vaccine and then the human papilloma virus infects your body, your body is ready to fight back with the antibodies that your body has made because of the vaccine. And then it can destroy the human papilloma virus. It's similar to the simulation with the yellow virus being attacked by the white antibodies that your body has made. Question number two. Can you get an HPV infection from the vaccine? No, 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 no. Why not? The VLPs or virus-like proteins can't reproduce and infect you. Remember that it doesn't have that inner genetic material that it needs to reproduce itself. On video one, I explained what a virus was. It needs an organism to reproduce itself and it needs the genetic material that the VLP does not have in order to reproduce itself. Therefore, you can't get infected by the vaccine. Question number three, what HPV does the vaccine protect you against? The current vaccine that's available in the US right now in 2019 is a nine valent vaccine, meaning it protects against nine of the HPV types. There had previously been a two and a four valent vaccine that have now stopped being produced leaving only the nine valent vaccine available in the United States. The HPV vaccine protects against HPV types 6 and 11, which are the low risk types to produce cancer, but they cause 90% of all genital warts, and high risk HPV types that can lead to cancer, type 16, 18, 31, 33, 45, 52, and 58. For women, the vaccine protects against vulvar cancer, vaginal cancer, cervical cancer, anal cancer, and genital warts. And for men, it prevents anal cancer and genital warts. Now to the Howl of Hope. A winner is just a loser who tried one more time. In the next video on the HPV vaccine, I will discuss who and who should not get the vaccine. If you have already received the vaccine, hit that thumbs up Hit subscribe if you don't want to miss any topics on women's health care. And thanks so much for watching.